This is what I call lateral transfer rotation. We have to move laterally by transferring our weight and rotating our core and our upper body. But as you can see, this NHL goalie doesn't do that. And the result is a goal. So right here, the player starts to move to the goalie's right. So right now, young keepers out there, he should be pushing with this foot to lateral transfer. And this arm here should be rotating towards the puck. But watch what happens. He throws this arm in the complete opposite direction of where the puck is going, which is to his right. So your body is obviously made up of two parts, a left and a right. If your left side is fighting against your right side, then A, your right side can't get there fast enough, and B, it can't get far enough because you're competing. Your muscles on your left side of your body are competing against your right, which slows you down. So as we roll the tape here, as you can see now his arm is almost completely behind him and his leg is outstretched here. This tells me he didn't push with this leg, he rather reached with this leg here. He didn't push to get over here, he just reached this leg out in desperation. But again, look at this arm, look at his body right here. If he brings that arm over and he pushes with this leg, a lateral transfer rotation, then he makes the save, or at the very least, it's not an easy goal like this is here. Lateral transfer rotation.